Hi guys, Sacred Girl 89 here. Welcome to my streams on my channel. It's great to see you all. So, we finally got that um, huge laser activated on top of the Rose, Rosie Marne Monastery, which was very interesting. And we got a cool, cool new weapon because of it. Anyway, we are going to continue Baldur's Gate 3. I don't think there's anything else left for us in the... Um, in this area so i think we'll be heading to the next um area which i think is some kind of dark lands but anyway all i can know is it's gonna be very interesting It's a bridge we need to take. Wait a minute, it's a path that we haven't been to yet, over here. No. Oh my, excuse me.
goodness me. Right. Right, so you can go back to these places. This takes us from... This takes us to different... Right, okay, uh... I did miss that face, you know. What the? Supreme Kithrak. Has Vlachit sent you to slay me with your own blade? I've not come to kill you, Lazel. I've come to aid you. Don't trust him.
Skakak Kir Gith Shabeleth. My blade rests. Mother Gith compels you to listen. Uh, what was that? She, I think we'll Speak. That. My ear is yours. I know you carry the astral prism, Lazel. Within it lies the seed of Vlakith's demise, and I intend to help you bring it to fruition. Vlakith's demise? Skaketh! I should run you through for suggesting it. If they have not said, they must have good reason, and I won't be the one to betray them. But the one inside's chosen you as an ally, protects you with their power. That very power will be the end of Vlakith's tyranny. The Prism's tenant must be let loose. I've sought their freedom for eons. When the Prism went missing, I feared the worst. Instead, you've granted the opportunity I've so long awaited. All that remains is the key that unchains them. And I've found someone who I believe can provide it. Bring the prism to Baldur's Gate. I'll be waiting in a taproom called Shares's Caress. That is where we decide the fate of my people. Lazel. Together we will break our chains and be Vlaketh slaves no longer. I am no slave, she's still Kithrak. The Undying Queen is my freedom. It is she who will purify me, and she who will ascend me. Lies, Lazel, every last one. There is no purification, no ascension. The Zaith Isk does not purify. It extracts memory and kills the infected. Nor does the Lich Queen glorify the Ascended. She feeds on most all of them to grow her power and pursue godhood. Madness! You flood me with this... this heresy! I... I will hear no more of it. Um, I think we'll leave this to Lizelle. I served Vlacketh the whole of my life. Learned her words, fought her battles, yet she names me her Sharlak. Your words carry truth. I will meet you in Baldur's Gate. Do not make me regret it. Lazel, I see Talakma gear in you, sister in freedom. Together we will be our people's light. Take this. It is a Quanith, a psionic detector. The Queen's warriors hunt you. The Quanith will sound you out when you come near their portals. Hear its cry and prepare for battle or slip away. I should go. Vlakith's gaze pierces the seas and skies. She believes me loyal, and I can't afford her mistrust. Keep the astral prism close. Let no one take it from you. Slay any who try. Now to Baldur's Gate. I'll be waiting, Lazo. Mm. Ooh. So we're going to meet Voss in the city, are we? Set the tenant of the prison free. This is all very, uh, I don't know. I like a good caper, but I'd long for a tiny bit of status quo now and again. Stop. 
Oh, man. So, Lazel's going to war with Vlakith. Going to break her chains in Baldur's Gate. Good for her. Hmm. He approves. Right. Wait a minute. Where's Gale? Vlakith cost seven crath crash head. Only in Vlakith may we find light. These were the first words I ever read on Tirsu Slate, but they are no mere aphorism. They are law. They are creed. The root from which the ten thousand protocols stem. Forsake one protocol and forsake Vlakith. Forsake Vlakith. And be the blood and meat which sates her dragons. If Voss speaks true, if ascension is a lie, if tadpole purification is a fairy tale, then I have not sinned against Flakith. She has sinned against me. Ascension is a young Gith Yankee's greatest honor. Long ago, the Gaith enslaved my people. They dominated our minds and bred us for war, until Great Mother Gith took a hammer to our bonds. From the day of our hatching, young Gith have one purpose, to train hard enough to slay a Gaith and take its head. Then, we speak the rite of Ascension, and a red dragon comes to fly us to Vlakith in Tunarath, City of Death. Cool. We are honored with an eternal home in the Astral, celebrated for our victory. We are ascended. Or so I believed. I don't know. I can't know. And that drives me mad. At first, I thought them an illithid deception, a trick of the tadpole. But the dream figure is real. It lives in the prism. Voss believes they are the seed of Vlakith's demise and the agent of Githyanki freedom. And I believe he may be right. I'd never thought Vlakith a tyrant, or me as a vassal. She was the source of my might, and I the envoy of her will. A warrior, a champion, a destroyer. But if Voss is right, and Vlakith consumes the Ascended to gain power, then I am no destroyer. I am mere livestock, bred to be harvested and devoured. Every Githyanki is a slave with a singular purpose. Not to cull the Geich, not to prevent their grand design, but to raise Vlakith to true godhood. Then, when the Kithraki come for me, and come they will, I will submit to their blades. They would feed me to their dragons, and I would deserve no better. Yes, I'd like time to think. We'll meet Kithrak Voss at Charesse's caress in Baldur's Gate. Until then, be vigilant. Vlakith's eyes are upon us. Mm -hmm. Where's everybody disappeared to? Even Alba and um, Finny are gone. Ah, 
Ah, there he is. What will Voss have to show for himself when we catch up with him, I wonder? His intelligence may yet prove the key to unlocking the artifact's secrets. We should ensure we follow up when we reach Baldur's Gate. That's welcome, so. There's a schism growing among the Githyanki people. And Lazel just took one step towards choosing a side. Talk to Starin about this, and we've also talked to Gala Karlak. I think we need to talk to Shudderha, obviously. I didn't expect Lazel to turn on the Lich Queen so readily. Wonders never cease. Fine. What's on your mind? How are you holding up? Don't be so modest. Yeah. We've already heard all that before. I just wondered if she wanted to say something different. Um... I wonder if we can check out that place where, you know, to these places before. That's curious. Good job we came back here. We might have missed on, on some loot. Why can't I open this thing? to a stallion. Right then. We'll have to shove our heart instead for once. Is it? I can. Uh, I I purposely don't want to get on top of the chest, and it does it. But when I do want to get on top of the chest, I won't do it. Jump then. Oh, 
Ah, fine. Take all these guys on and some more experience points. The dance macabre. Torment. A better position. A better position. I'm going to enjoy this. Ha 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 ha! Oh yeah, so fake, I would. Hungry for the slaughter. Everybody get out the cloud of daggers, please, my goodness me. to see you sauntering over then I'll see you tonight you sweet generous thing I'm not a star I mean, when are we gonna have make love again <laughs> well I know that was random but oh well
such a looks a lot of that uh, duh. Oh! <laughs> wow, that worked! I'm quite funny actually. I didn't even mean to attack the support, I was just going to have a look to see what was there. Oh, what's in here? There we go. Barney for now, so I want to check out that um, star room and then we're going to go back and then we're going to go to the um, lands. Great God Helm, allow us peace in this plane and beyond. Teach us care when we would be reckless. Teach us certainty when we would have doubt. So <coughs> Before my time. There we go. Because I did say they were moving on, so maybe they have done by now. So I'm gonna go check it out. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Jasmine Jin, for the follow. I do appreciate it. Hey, mate. Hi there. Welcome to stream. How are you doing? Ah, the still bear. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Thank you. You okay? Please let me thank you. Right. <laughs> What's up? I'm good. I'm glad to see you good. Yeah, yeah. Smell that. Blood. This whole plane reeks of it. Hmm. That'll wake you up of a fine day, won't it? I do not need awakening. My senses are sharp as steel. Hmm. Nice game. Have fun. Oh, thank you. Um, and thank you for popping in. And, and the follow, of course. Well, 
What kind of game do you mostly play on stream? I do have, I do stream Dead by Daylight quite a lot as well as um, this game, but obviously it's quite a long one. Baldur's Gate, Northwest. Elturel, South. Moonrise Towers West. Ooh. That's pretty cool, I love it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Is this your first time on the Salt Coast, Blazel? Yes. It is much more lively than the Githyanki slates led me to believe. Just wait till you see Baldur's Gate. You'll never want to leave. What's your screen schedule for upcoming days? I do first week Fortnite. I do Fortnite on Mondays. For um, Tuesdays, I do Mario and Rabbit Sparks of Hope. On Wednesdays and Thursdays, Baldur's Gate 3. And on Saturdays and Sundays, Dead by Daylight. great I will come oh have fun okay thank you and see you on the next see you on the, the next time I stream thank you very much uh it was nice talking to you yep I just want to check and I get a follow follow back there uh yeah I'll have a look at your profile There's no way to cross this bridge, is there? Yeah, no. Oh, that looks really anonymous over there. Lizelle. Do you want to talk about what happened at the crash? Trust me, you'll know when I'm ready to discuss it. Fair enough. But if you change your mind... It is not a matter of mind. It is a matter of faith. And I have been put to the test. Hmm. Sure, I'll be waiting by that thing. But thank you. BTW, thanks. You're welcome. Do not walk in darkness. Turn to the light. By the way. By the way. Yeah, no, thank you. And hello there, Steph. Welcome to stream. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Oh, good. How are you? I'm good, thank you. <laughs> right, double check. I don't think I need to do anything else here. No. 
Let's go in. Shadow Curse Lands. Oh. Thickens. Ooh. Tell me some tips and tricks related to swimming. Oh. What the? One minute. Can you feel that? The dark, it's hungry. Best watch the shadows. Anyway, um, well, what do you mean um, tips and tricks, Steph? What would you like to know? I'll take that as a yes. Listen up. Grab a torch. Stay out of the dark and move fast. Shadows have eyes. Go on. Like I lose stamina while swimming, get tired real quick and breath problem. Okay, um, D when what what stroke are you doing? What stroke are you doing? What stroke do you do, Steph? Just like, like just swimming normally. No, but what I mean is, do you do front crawl, back stroke, um, breast stroke, or even, um, oh, what do you call it? Butterfly, butterfly. Because it depends what stroke you're doing, where you need to on, well this is a thing, this is how you need to, depending on the stroke, you need to know how to breathe properly. Yeah, yeah, butterfly. Right. So, according to the, let me, let me pause this. According to what I've been taught to teach kids, when it comes to the butterfly is obviously you do your butterfly tail, mermaid tail, dolphin tail, whatever so you do six of those one, two, breathe but as you obviously when your face is down in the water then you breathe out you don't hold your breath you never hold your breath you never hold your breath while swimming and obviously it will make you go faster but yeah you gotta make sure that you breathe come to breathe up but you must make sure that you breathe that you blow bubbles under the water like we teach kids obviously not enough not to exhaust yourself straight away like whoo like Hah! but not more like to go but yeah, so basically that's what I would do personally. Hmm, 
Uh, you obviously you checked out my profile, which is great. Thank you. Cool. So I don't know. Is that what is that what happens? Are you not breathing as much as you should? Are you holding your breath? What's going like? Cool. Is is that's what's happening? So basically, I do it. If I've I've been told six of the because you do your obviously you're wiggling very fast. So obviously, and you do one, two, three, breathe, one, two, three. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like these lungs already. Fine. I have to admit, I don't like this. Gored to death by the look of it. Camp. Right. But yeah, um, anyway, I don't like this place. Mm. So it's best to keep a torch with you in the darkness. Place. Well, send us to camp. We've got loads of water. A pile of belongings forsaken to the curse so that their owners could escape with their lives. Forsaken to the curse, so that their owners could escape. It feels like them. we're being watched, hunted, even. Mm. But there's nothing out there. Only more darkness. I much prefer it when I'm the one prowling in the shadows, about to strike. Sorry, did you want something, or just looking for a distraction? Nice car, I have to say. Do you feel that? I've never felt so cold, and that's me. This place will swallow us whole if we let it. Stick close to Mama K. <laughs> Mama K. I have to admit, Carla is best. Girl. I thought to reach a Githyanki crash and be rid of these tadpoles. Now we stalk forgotten lands haunted by darkness. Right. 
Hey, boy. You want the bone? Fish! <laughs> See that blight ago? Swallowed all by the shadow curse. Bet he was pure tasty. You're the true soul we're taking to Moonrise, I'm guessing. Aye, in the shallows. But a curse don't care about some itty bitty light once you get deeper. Don't worry, boss. We've got a guide. Oh. Talk to Kansif inside. He'll run through it. <laughs> that sounds so badass. <laughs> Wait, you, you, you're joking, yeah? But we're ready to go. You just need to tell Kansif inside. Of course. Yeah, good one. <laughs> That's quite funny. Now, uh, we best get going, eh? I made him scared. Maybe I won't do it again. Oh. Say bye bye. Definitely send those to Starian. There we go. Nothing. Just the dark. True soul. An honor. Did you bring the liar? We were told to expect a true soul. That Night Warden Mintharo would send someone with her liar to summon a guide through the darkness. I admit. I'm surprised the true soul does not know this. Where are you headed, exactly? I fear neither of us are traveling, then. The darkness here is murderous. The only safe way through is with a guide. Of course, you are free to take your chances if you wish. But I will be waiting here for the Night Warden's liar. Ah, you do have it. Then pluck a tune, and our guide will come scuttling. Okay. Ooh. Oh, yay, botched it. Them, your majesty, calling us their god and their guide together. Okay. Gods, one of Lolth's abominations. Greetings, and the Absolute's name. You have been charged with guiding us. New flesh for you, my queen. But who are they? Best introduce yourself. Perhaps you'll listen to her true soul. And 
you? What are you? More faithful of the Absolute. They need a guide to the tower, same as us. Your minds connect, and you hear a whispered voice. The Absolute. Or just the echoes of his fractured mind reverberating in the dark. <laughs> a true soul. You have more worshippers every day, Majesty. We have our queen's favor. She speaks to us, protects us, graces us with her blessing. And her magic lamp. Uh, they are jealous of your gift, Majesty. But you gave it to us. And we always keep it close. No! Our queen gave it to us. Sorry. Would they wish to walk through the darkness alone? They are welcome to. Good. Now, are we ready to depart? Bless us again, Majesty. Shine your light. Protect us. Come. Follow and stay close. Do not leave the light. Do not feed. The shadows. You heard him. Move out. Okay. They should stay closer, my queen. And they should stay in light. Unless they want to become shadows. I apologize to anybody who's got any uh, fear of spiders or acrophobia. I mean, I have to admit, I think this guy's a bit. They must keep up. The shadows are hungry. What is this? Ain't all got ten legs. Prime spot for an ambush. Patience, Majesty, you bless us. are clearly enemies of the absolute they could be worthwhile allies but defend the guide and you may preserve your cover as a true soul Ooh. kill them turn the heathens to pieces Oh, 
Right, uh... Seems good. little things. No better than the shadows. But no matter. 
Majesty, they are already dead and soon forgotten. Oh shoot, we need to follow him. Quickly, quickly. Right, let's get going. <coughs> Nothing is it. One day I'll catch a break. Don't be shy. what I call a spied. to live in more interesting times. Bones. They must get on. They must hurry. I'm back. Must stay right. Making me sweat.
wants to die. The Dark Majesty? Watch your back. Again. Over there. Come on. Why can't we still do the turn? No, 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 no. I will never believe this. have seen everything. What's cooking? If you insist. Turn to the light. Eager for battle. Objective noted. Subtle stones. Who's an heretic's majesty? for your thoughts. What's going on? I don't know what's going on here. Strider's light protects us. Don't wander off unless you want to be devoured by shadow. Mm -hmm. I need a quick word. We must press forward. I have a confession. I was too... I thought you witless, gutless, unimpressively bland. I don't pay compliments. I only say what is true. You've proven me wrong at every turn. Ooh. You are efficient, dominant, courageous. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon for plunging into another. You've gained my respect, and more still, my yearning. When I come near, your odor alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hairs stand on end. If you must know, Vlakith requires everything of her children. I can't count how many bruises I've inflicted. Can't measure how much blood I've drawn in the Undying Queen's name. I know only blood red and death black. My mind is silver, and my body steel. Ooh. I am what I must be. Say what I must be. To survive every beast I face and every wound I bear. Bah. Enough talk. I will be plain. 
I want to taste you. Uh -oh. Perhaps tonight, perhaps later. But I want it all the same. Sorry. Do you? Your loss, I fear. One day soon, you will wonder how my lips might have tasted, how my fingers on your skin might have felt, uh, and you will wish you could return to this lost moment. Soldier, listen. Greetings. Story. What a day. All right. Dread lightly. Return to the light. Quickly Sorry. then. Waste a step. They leave us again. Very well, my queen. We will wait. Come on, let's go. Flackets will be done. Proceeding. Someone there. A little small talk. Twitchy stone skin. Afraid of the dark. In this place, only a fool wouldn't be. Looking ahead. Turn to the light. Need to find a way forward. Strained. Don't burn yourself. Want me to die in the dark, Majesty? Assume nothing. They leave us again. One true way. To get out of this turn as well. What now? Go. Turn to the light. To the Still breathing, despite everything. Greeting. to die in the dark, Majesty? They leave us again. Hmm. Very well, my queen. What do we have here? We will wait. Mm -hmm. Come back! We must stay. Black, it's well be done. Majesty. Without delay. Hello. Strange. Moving. 
all right. What now? Open up. Thanks. La la la. <laughs> Eager for battle. We must, must speak. Stay Onward. Majesty. How delicious. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Return to the light. Strength. Oh. Once to die in the dark, Majesty. Mind and well, in it. Attention. Saddle up. Assume nothing. Repositioning. Stay in the light, Majesty. Let's get going. Return to the light. Right. Do the fools want to die in the dark, Majesty? They leave us again. Never wanted the easy I'm part. Back. to be alive. Oh, yeah. Hindrance breeds madness. I'm 
objective noted. Let's be quick. Okay, and then come back. We must stay in the light. These things have stayed interesting. How much farther can I go? Well, well, well. Well, that ends. We'll wait. Not as bad as it could have. Hey, good looking. Come back. We must stay in the light, Majesty. We have to go back to him. Is that wise? Action, not reaction. Well, hello. No one stopped me yet. Ah, there we are. We need to stay close to him, that's why. Time to press ahead. Damn, it's good to be alive. Let's go! What the heck is that over there? Action, not reaction. An efficient path. Someone there? <sighs> Watch the shadow. Stay close. The shadows are darkest here, hungriest here. Do not stray from the light, no matter what they promise you. Okay. That dried as mad as a box of Grimishkas. Then again. You'd have to be mad to spend your days marching through this gloom. Hmm. Majesty. They leave us again. Action, not reaction. I will be heard. Hello, my queen. Hello, my sweet. <laughs> Casador, sired seven spawn. Me and my six. Brothers and sisters. He always insisted we were a family, even when he was carving scars into our flesh. I was one of his first. Some of the others came years later. He was a monster to us all, but did take special pleasure in my pain. He said, My screams sounded sweetest. Oh, that's fine. And now that I'm gone, I, I don't know. I pity the other six. Oh, Starvian. This is why we need to give each other kisses and cuddles. And more, of course. Quickly then. I bind. Return to the Don't light. linger. Do not stray. No one back home will ever believe this. She mind my step. Want to die in the dark. What a charm. Got it. So much time. They leave us again. Wasted. I'm hearing something. This doesn't sound good. Very well, my queen. Eager for battle, without delay. What now? Come back! This way. The most stay. I have a lot on my mind. Just and, well, in it. Look! Just look! Breathe deep and move. 
What's cooking? There we go. Eager for battle. Quickly then. Watch your back. Step quick. Still alive, so that's progress. Black, it's will be done. Wait, there we are. There's the tower now, big lad. Your bridge is still clean. My blade is, but that can change. Just keep talking. They will be silent. Approach your sanctuary, Majesty. Is that blood? No, never mind. Greetings. Let's march. All right. Okay. Keep your distance, darling. They there. Us again. Very well, my queen. Come back. I must stay <coughs> right. I've got a long road ahead. Don't be shy. Toes, toes. Stray. Assume nothing. Soldier. It could have. We're close. I can feel it. The absolute. His power is strong here. Well, well, well. Excuse. While I'm at it. Playtime's over. <coughs> so, pack up your ears. You and the pup have a new mission. Absolute's cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil. And a powerful one at that. They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Moonrise Towers. And you're getting him out. Questions. You're wasting my time. Let's see about getting your priorities fixed. <clears throat> Clause Z, Section 13. 
Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lean mule. I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh and sinks to a vernus. You either mount a quick rescue, or you condemn Will to an eternity sizzling in the hells. Sounds like an easy choice to me. Nazora's words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. She cannot afford for Will to fail this mission. This may be your best chance to negotiate Will out of his pet. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? Give that a try. Oh, we botched it. Incredible. You actually think you hold the winning hand? Fine. I'll play your game. But I amend the pact once the mission's done, not before. Clause F. Section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soulbearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Now, get to Moonrise, and do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. Mm. No time to rest. New meat drider. <laughs> oh, the queen said them. Her Majesty's flesh grows full and glorious. <laughs> Helped us with some harpers on the way, too. They're shadow bait now. <laughs> Move. His thoughts seek yours, searching, grasping. Your parasite squirms in recognition. Disciple Zarel's in the Great Hall. She'll be wanting to see you. Rest of you, head on in. The others will go in, but I will go up. My queen summons me to her chapel, to be in her presence. I hear you, sweet majesty. I am coming, my queen. Hmm. Well. I'll just be one minute. I need to go blow my nose. I'll be right back. Excuse me. I'll, please excuse me while I go. Eat. Eat. Make
There can be no doubt. This is the place. This is where we'll discover the secret of the absolute. Another true soul. The disciple wants to see you through the main doors. Well, Flo didn't tell a lie. She said you'd find me, and here you are. Carla, isn't it? Now there's a name I'd hope never to hear again. What was Flo doing here? Didn't think to quiz her about her business. Florenta the Garotta. Cambion I knew back in Avernus. She was the closest thing I had to a friend. That said, she would have choked the life out of me if I ever turned my back on her. Oh. The fact that she knows where I am, or where I might be going, doesn't exactly delight me. Maybe. Probably. I don't know. She's a half-devil. Impossible to read. I wouldn't have given her the time of day, but even I needed a laugh once in a while. What can I say? The bitch had good jokes. <laughs> Enough chatter. Your friend gave me three soul coins, said I could sell them if I wanted. But if I kept them for you, she'd consider it a favor owed. Soul coins, huh? This could come in handy. Sure. But she did have a condition. For every coin you take, you've got to hear the story of the soul trapped inside. There you have it. Flo came all this way just to try to make me feel like shit. Clever use of her time. <laughs> Memorized a bunch of sad stories on her behalf, did you? Didn't need to. <coughs> Your Flo did some devil woo-woo and stuck him in my head. Couldn't forget now if I wanted to. You want the coins or not? First coins got the soul of a woman named Mavery. She was born to a cruel mother and a violent father and three evil brothers, all named Balder. Oh. She never knew a day of love in all her life. When she was a girl of 15, she sold her soul to Tiamat in exchange for someone who would love her unconditionally. Uh -oh. She got what she asked for. A fellow named Clint destined to be her soulmate, struck by a cart and died a few moments after clapping eyes on her bravery. <coughs> Poor guy. The scud of her soul is yours now. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> sure you will. This one has got the soul of a man named Frakes. Lived in a village near Neverwinter. Hit hard by the worst hunger in a thousand years. Ooh. Frakes called out for help. Prayed for his children to have meat to eat. Zariel answered. Made old Frakes grow flesh upon flesh after flesh. His wee ones had all the meat they could stomach. He should have known. Better to die a thousand deaths than let Zariel into your life. Whatever you need to tell yourself. Last one's got the soul of a little boy named Ongear. Eight years old. 
He liked playing in the sun with his friends. That's all I know. That's all? That's all. Oh, and this slip of scratch. Well, thanks, Flo. Hearing <coughs> a bunch of desperate horror has ruined my day, which I suppose was the point. You got three soul coins out of the bargain, didn't you? I'd quit whinging if I were you. I did my part. That means our business is done. Unless you've got actual gold to hand. Better hope you can handle what I've got. Oh. If you have coin, then show it. Get moving, will you? All right, well, Nick. Where do you hail from? I was a farrier in. Ah, a new face come to bask in the light of the absolute. How can I be of service, true soul? Blessed by association, let's say. I come to pay proper respect to a new power. I bow, but the Zenterim prefer to look their business partners in the eye. Joaquin's clipped coins? No. Faith is an over-flooded market. Transport, however. These faithful folk need some goods moved into the city. Our ships are obliging. Quietly. less and less like a true believer with every word. But what would I know of faith? I cater to more earthly needs. Better we focus on that, hmm?
An honor, true soul. These are our allies, those, Erna. We once we'll handle justice. the diplomacy. You just keep looking pretty. How are you doing? Oh, I'm fine, Miami. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? that I'm doing pretty amazing. Oh, that's good. Sorry, they're going so far. It's going good, thank you. Good, thank you. Oh, hello, a little cat. The 
Feline eyes the parasite with a glint in her eye. Intent clear. Murder. Glorious murder. Uh oh. I'm way too big. We did as we was told, General. Followed every order. The facts suggest otherwise. You were ordered to retrieve the artifact. You failed to do so. Us? No, no, it was Minfara. She got the orders. She... Enough! A blast of mental energy washes over you, filling the room. Your tadpole squirms, urging you to obey. You failed to retrieve the artifact. You failed to protect your true soul. You do not deserve to live. Uh, by the way, how long have you been streaming, like in general? I've been streaming. I'll be a few. It will be three years come October. So I've been streaming for a little while. A new true soul come to share their wisdom? We did as we were told! We're loyal to the Absolute! Tell him! Silence! True soul, you have seen these goblins at work, have you not? What say you? See? What I tell ya? Okay. Praise the absolute. Faith without action is anemic, sickly, in a word, useless. We are too close to the ending and the new beginning. I can coddle failure no longer. Kill them quickly. <laughs> Thank you. She's an unbeliever outside my control. On the um, Fridays of that stream. Try again. <laughs> no. No! 
Dispose of the rest as you see fit. Or better yet, put that true soul to use. You have far more important matters to attend to. Or have you forgotten? Of course not, my lord. Thank you. You heard the general. The goblins are yours. Deal with them however you wish. They are yours. You can release them, kill them, or feed them to each other for all I care. Just deal with them. Okay. Here in the seat of the Absolute's power, your authority over them is complete. They will obey any command. Report to me upstairs when you're done. Please! You gotta help me! For old time's sake! <laughs> You know what? We need all the help we can get. Oh, praise the absolute! And praise her true soul! Oh, you exhaust me. Compassion is not a virtue. The seat of the absolute's power. Occupied by a general that cannot be killed. But his followers Thank are you. flesh and blood. We must learn what fuels his power. General Thorm's prayers and preparations must not be disturbed. The rooftop is off limits to everyone. Even you, Disciples Rel? Everyone. Keep watch and ensure that nobody passes. Excellent timing, true soul. The goblins. Tell me how they suffered. No, better yet. Show me. Her mind enters yours abruptly, flickering across your memories in a blaze of excitement. She sees the goblins walking free, and a burning rage fans across your mind like wildfire. Explain yourself. Wow. I didn't expect you to do that. I was hoping you'd be able to help with something more important, but you're only fit to muck out the jail cells. That won't keep my blade from your throat if you continue to disappoint me. Let's see if there's anything interesting in this brain of yours. She parts the folds of your mind again, touching your wants and hopes, tasting them. Every emotion soaks into her mind's palate. But there is purpose to her exploration. She is searching for proof of your faith. Ooh. Please, please. Yes. <clears throat> My, my. Your lust for the neck pricker is succulent. I'd like to take a bite out of him myself. With the absolute, your fantasies can become more real than flesh. The pleasures of the mind can surpass those of the body. I have already been blessed to stand in her presence. It was bliss. She gave me everything I wanted. By serving General Thorn. I have a mission for you. That's it. Play along. The closer you can get to the General, the closer you'll be to the answers you seek. You feel her presence in your head again. She grips your mind, 
squeezing until your vision blurs with pain. The Absolute's blessings have far greater value than any price you could name. Be wise. Obey. There is a relic that General Thorm requires. He sent his most trusted advisor, Disciple Balthazar, to retrieve it. The relic is beneath the Thorm family mausoleum. That is where you will find Balthazar. But we have lost contact with him. Go there. Aid Balthazar if you can. And bring the relic home. It is something that General Thorm desires, and that he has ordered us to retrieve. That is all you need to know. She's suddenly nervous, on edge. Talking about the relic makes her Ooh. anxious. Well, let's do it. I don't get anxious, I get impatient. You have your mission. And I accompanied him. It was destroyed shortly after he left Moonrise. Hardly a surprise. We're protected here, but outside the shadows are hungry. Death would not silence Balthazar for long. But dead or alive, he is lost. Whatever has become of him, it is the relic that matters. The shadows around the mausoleum are deep and hungry. You will need a moon lantern to survive them. Take one from Balthazar's chambers. But don't pry. The last person who snooped into his secrets lost their head. I believe he uses it as a chamber pot. Oh. Right then. We need to save Gamer, we need to come off obviously. But this is very interesting. Right then. Main menu. <coughs> right then guys. This has been a really good stream and you know we've got quite a lot of we've accomplished quite a lot in this stream as well um so yeah thank you very much for joining me the next time i will be streaming as i just mentioned to carter um will be saturday at 8 p.m. UK time, guys. No, I think 8.30 p.m. UK time, guys. Where I'll be doing um, Dead by Daylight. I might cancel. I might cancel if I might need to do something before then. Might need to do something before then. But um, also, I need to do it on my schedule. But I'm not um, doing a Sunday stream. Because I'm um, going to London. So, yeah. Anyway. Um, again, thank you very much for joining me, guys, and I'll hopefully see you on Saturday. Please stick around, we're going to raid somebody. Um, if you want me to raid a particular person, um, spend your channel points on the viewer reward for um, raiding somebody. Right, let me see who can we raid today. The camping back, is it? Um, no, it's just not allowed to go to camp holes if you're on the path. Right, um, sorry, I was just having a look on somebody's channel, I beg your pardon.
We have it in the barn, yeah, they're, they're live right now. Right then guys, send all your sacred love to Nug Bone, spam sacred red in the chat and if you're a subscriber please use that red amount of mine and I'll hopefully see you for Saturday night for more Dead by Daylight at 8.30pm UK time guys. Um, Have a good evening, good night and I'll see you later. Bye now. Thank you very much. Bye now. Thank you. Bye.